evening. I'm Valerie Pritchett. I'm Alicia Richards. Thank you for joining us. More Pennsylvania firefighters are heading out west in a matter of hours. Wildfires in the western part of the country continue to take a major toll. Jeremiah Marshall joins us now with our top story. Jeremiah. Now, Alicia, Valerie, this is a team of 20 that will fly out to Montana early tomorrow morning to replace their current team from Pennsylvania that's already there. Firefighters we spoke to say this is a big job. We could end up in Idaho, we could stay in Montana, we could go out to Oregon, we're not sure. Once we get out there, we'll get assigned a resource order. Firefighters, along with Pennsylvania Department of Conservation and Natural Resource Workers, will make their way to Missoula, Montana to help with the ongoing wildfires. In this mobilization meeting, crew leaders say the number one goal is safety. I want to make sure people that want training get trained, I want to get new guys experience, and I just want to make sure we go out there, do our job safely, and everyone gets home safe. The mission can come with challenges from keeping up with morale after long hours to being far away from loved ones. You know, you're you're away from your family for, you know, a couple weeks, you know, so if you have some guys that haven't been on an assignment like this, you know, the new guys that aren't accustomed to that, that can be challenging to overcome. This team will replace the current crew taking on the wildfires that have been raging for the past couple of weeks. Firefighters say it's important to step in when help is needed. It's the urge to help, you know, if you can make some sort of a difference. Um, you get to see some different parts of the country that, you know, some people may never ever get to see. It gives Pennsylvania um, a pretty good reputation to be able to go out there and assist with other resources especially other states. So I want to give back to the program and keep it going. And this crew will be helping with these wildfires for the next two weeks. In studio, Jeremiah Marshall, ABC 27 News. Thank you, Jeremiah.